shared to us by the uh, IMD department. Uh, it has been raining consistently uh, since last few days in the state of Haryana, Himachal Pradesh and that of Uttarakhand as well, which is the reason why there is increase in water in the river Yamuna because Yamuna, Yamuna finds its origin from the Yamunotri which is in Uttarakhand and after passing from the state of Uttarakhand, it connects to the uh, Haryana and then it goes from the capital city towards different part of the country. So as of now, this is uh, one of the prominent reasons as to why the uh, there has been an increase in the river Yamuna and although uh, if we talk about the capital city, there has been no significant rainfall since last uh, a week so to say but as of now we can see that because of the rainfall in uh, some other states it is causing again a flat like situation in the capital city because if we talk about the overall danger mark level has been crossed already in the capital city and this is the picture which we are showing you on the screen of CNN News 18 all the way from the ITO Yamuna barrage where some of the workers including that of the personals they are also working tirelessly to open the remaining gates as mentioned by Akash as well so this is one such prominent area uh, and actually we have told you earlier as well that the maintenance of this particular area is uh, in the hand of the Haryana government. But nevertheless, apart from politics, a few of the gates have already been opened up, but there are some of the gates which are still, uh, they needs the remaining work to be done at the earliest. There are some kind of technical problem which is being faced for the reopening of that particular gate. But if it reopens, it will further help the water advance in other part of the river Yabuna. But yes, there are chances that the if, if, if the water goes beyond a particular point, because the peak which the Yamuna uh, has achieved in the capital city, it is of 208.65 mark and currently it is prevailing at uh, somewhere uh, around 206 point something. But it will also expose if uh, the water, uh, water comes out uh, on the roads of the capital cities, uh, uh, what we have seen in the last few days and it will further expose the challenges and also the preparations which have been done by the civic authorities in the last few days. But yes, there are some parts, some villages of the Ghaziabad in particular which has already been flooded by the river Yamuna and on that side there is uh, Hindan river which has been uh, you know seeing increase in the water. But uh, despite no rainfall in the capital city as mentioned earlier, the level of the river Yamuna, the water level is continuously rising in the city and now we need to see as to, to what extent it is going to rise and is the water yet again going to come out on the roads of the capital city or not. For that we will have to wait for a while. But as of now, apart from uh, river Yamuna, all the low-lying area in the capital city, they are as of now, as we speak, it is safe and sound, be it ITO, be it Rajghat, be it civil lines or the Yamuna Bazaar area, as of now there is no report of flooding as such. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on.